Yes, welcome back to my video tutorials. This is ABM Graphics. Yes, today I just want to show you this particular tag and in Photoshop. Yes, you can see that you get you see someone do a shape, either a rounded shape, a rectangular, a square, and you put someone in there, but some of the parts will come out in a such a way that maybe he draw a circle and the whole body is in the circle, but you can see the head the head side will come out from the circle. How do you do that in Photoshop? So that is what I just want to show you today and you get it clear. And when you when you get it, practice and practice, you'll be able to come master in it. Yes. So let's just go into our Photoshop like this. So what should I do now? Right now I'll just come and create a new document then I'll make it add an illustration then I'll make it 100 pixels by 100 pixels over here like that. Then the next thing I have to do is go to put in the picture. But you know, sometimes if you are if you are to do that, let me use this. So this is PNG picture. Normally you can only use PNG picture to do that. So if your picture what the kind of picture that you want to use if it's not png then you need to crop out all the background then and let the picture stand you get it and let it stand yes so let's go just just work with that so the first thing i have to do is to close out this one then the first thing i'll draw i'll come and pick my rectangular tool over here then i'll come and draw ellipse ellipse two that's circular circle two yes then i'll change the color to this you get that this one you see that then I'll make watch something over here this one is back of the shape here so move it top so that you come over here so what we'll do now over here is that I want to clip it in so that the hair the head over here will not go in to the distance but over here will go into the shape you get that yes so the first thing i have to do is to come on over here this picture i'll duplicate it two so i'll duplicate it so that i have two distance i'll have two circles over there so what this one clip in you can make it you can call it clip in okay and this one you can either call it layer mask adding layer mask i'll show you two methods adding layer mask okay adding oh i'm sorry adding layer mask 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 okay so this is it so this one i'll right click then create clipping mask you get that so this one has clipping but this one i'll add layer i'll, I'll add the layer mask there you get that so this is the layer mask over here and i'll just click once and i'll have it like this so here over here is what white so when it's white you come and pick a brush you can just pick a soft brush like this yes then you make sure that this place over here should be black you get that because here is what white here should be black then you click this arrow so to go what to go on top this way so what you now do is that you start brushing brush it up like this simple very simple you get that let's see something over here i'll make here white so when i make it white when i'm brushing it will mind me because here's white and here's white it will never do but what you need to do is to make the, this place what uh black then you can brush it up like that you have clipped it in like that beautiful simple so this is how we make that tag in photoshop yes so the next the the, the 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 next thing i'll show you is that let me just delete it the next thing i'll show a show again is that after click after creating the clipping mask over here let's create a clipping mask this way you see that everything has gone in 
then I'll honor this one. Then what I'll do is that I'll just come and pick a rectangular marking tool over here. Then I'll come over here, then delete it. I'll just select it and then click what? Delete. It will go in. Simple. This is another step in Photoshop if you want to clip in a picture and some parts you know appears out that is what you will do so so let's just have it done so uh, after that what you do you can now use it to do anything you want to do and it's only it's not only circle that you can do that you can also use different shape and different kind of thing so let me just use something shape like this then I'll change the color to this place. This wait, wait, okay. I'll change it this way. It's okay. Then for me, I'll transform it. Right click. Then I'll I'll skew it over here. Then I'll skew this one over here. Then I'll have it like this. Okay. Then I'll click. Okay. You get that. Then I'll move it in small. It's okay for me. So I'll come back. This is it. It should be here. I'll delete this one away. Then I'll have it to be somewhere here. You get that? Then I'll create a clipping mask in. Then I'll duplicate this one. Okay. Then I'll release the clipping mask over there. Then what should I do next? I'll just add a layer mask. Then I'll come and pick my brush and start brushing out. The past, I don't want it to appear simple. So, this is how we clip in those kind of tech. And when it comes to Photoshop, thank you very much for watching. Have a nice day. Bye bye.